Alright guys, shout out to Motocross Mad and Domination Squad for supporting the channel. You guys are awesome and I appreciate that a ton. We have the shout out done, now let's get in to the video. So Milestone has been releasing a ton of games recently. On the Moto scene, they're the creators of the MXGP games and we also saw them release Monster Energy Supercross, the official video game, which it's pretty crazy to see a, a company pair up with Supercross to make an official game. But here's the thing guys, will the Milestone Motocross games be around? forever is the player base going to survive i personally think we need to see some more changes within the game especially from year to year within the mxgp games and after four games being released that are based on the same thing it can kind of start to get a little dry something has to change so that's what we're going to be talking about here today in this video the mxgp games in the future of milestone and the mx games in general let's get right into it so guys before we get into my thoughts on this topic let me know down in the comments below do you guys enjoy the MXGP games? Is Milestone doing a good job from year to year? Or do we need to see some improvements and changes from the game to last another year? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new and let's get in to the video. There have been four MXGP games released starting with MXGP1, MXGP2 the year after, and then of course MXGP3 the year after that. And then finally here we have MXGP Pro, which was released here in 2018. It's the most recent installment in the series. Now, of course, each new game brings little improvements, but the core of the game is pretty much the same. We see little tweaks such as new riders, track improvements, and the main one I noticed from year to year is the graphical improvements. But is this enough to keep us coming back for more every time they release a game? I find that after playing, you know, four installments of the game, it's starting to get a little bit dry. I get that the game is based around the MXGPs, so we are going to get some, some overlapping content, like pretty much the same tracks and riders and all that, but the game needs more it's getting boring it's getting boring that's the simplest way to put it it needs to bring more to the table to keep everyone hooked in and keep everyone wanting to play the game previous games had the mx destinations as part of the game and with mxgp pro they literally just took that out of the game and kind of took a step backwards so yeah we got a compound to explore but mx destinations is a huge part of the game. I'd rather have it in the game over a compound any day. It's stuff like that that kind of has me concerned. I want to see the game taking steps forwards and not head down the wrong path. Of course, we've got the pro physics, which is new. It's a new thing, but it's not a huge, exciting game feature to keep us coming back. The graphics in MXGP Pro are outstanding. Like they're amazing, and that's a huge part of the game but it doesn't make it what it is. If we saw these changes accompanied by major game changes, it might actually spice some things up a little bit, change some things up and keep us wanting more. Another example of going backwards is the whips. Whips in MXGP Pro are terrible, and this is definitely a step backwards for the game. It just doesn't feel like the developers are really making any huge improvements or changes to the game, and it's pretty easy for them to, you know, just change the tracks up a little from year to year and create some new menus, use the same riders and everything, and it's starting to almost just be you know money like they're getting money from it so why why stop they can just improve a little bit and then and then bam make more money boom change a little bit get more money i want to see bigger changes like bigger and better things maybe that's just like my look on it but i find that milestone like isn't bringing enough to the table to keep me hooked the graphics aren't enough to keep me coming back and like I never thought I'd say it, but the new MX vs ATV game, MX vs ATV All Out, 
has better whips than MXGP Pro. It's just such a bummer seeing the game take steps in the wrong direction and like I want the games to do good. I want new moto games every year but I don't think Milestone will last forever if they continue doing what they are doing. It's a pretty interesting topic the more you kind of think about it and I want you guys to let me know down in the comments your opinions on it. Do you guys like MXGP Pro? Is it good enough to make you want the next game too? Do you want more milestone games or are we starting to kind of burn out on the same old MX GP game year after year. Let me know down in the comments below. This video was a quick little rant, so I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, smash that thumbs up button for me. If you're new around here and you made it to the end of the video, go down and smash that subscribe button and become a member of the Goon Squad. Now guys, that's it for me. Remember, oppose nothing, conquer everything. Peace out. That was a rant and a half, yo. I hope that made sense. Oh, it's all good. <laughs>